I don't know, like 90-something on... Let me look it up now. 90, 90, 90 plus everywhere. Baldur's Easily the best RPG in the last 15 years. Well, it's... I mean, has anything had this much TLC? Like, tender loving care? Like, no. Uh, like a, that is the what, problem. That is the, yeah. that's, that is a problem with video games. The one thing, though, I and I know Chris harped on this, too, because I, I'm seeing so many... Because I, I read a lot of Steam reviews of it. Uh, and there's so many dickheads that are just like, see, this is how you do it with no microtransaction, this, this, that. I'm like, as if this is going to make it change that. Like, as if moving yeah. forward, all of a sudden, companies are going to be like, oh, let's not maximize profits anymore. Let's just please the gamer. Like, they don't give a fuck about that shit, bro. Well, the, thi the, the thing is this, yeah, right? The thing is this, right? Yeah. When, you, when you actually, like, you have to, if you care, you care. You know, if you don't care, you don't care. Right. Um, D Baldur's Gate is one of the most is up there with the most iconic Norton Western RPGs of all time. Like the name of it is like very high. It's like that in Dragon Age and um, Mass Effect Two and Elder Scrolls. Like those right. are the okay. those are the Western RPGs. You know, yeah. yeah. To even be given the ID IP to make a game for them, you have to prove to the company it's very it's very serious. Larian made patch after patch. They released it early access for a long time. They listened to the community. They were like, hey, this is a problem. They went back, they scrubbed it. Added new stuff. They constantly did time and time and time on it. Not to mention, narratively, this is Dungeons and Dragons. Nothing is going to beat that world narratively. It's, it's, it's the world of imagination. Any way you think you can interact with the world in this game, you can. And it's to the point it's ridiculous. To the point that, like, even me, I get, like, sidetracked. Where I'm like trying to go do something, and then I'm like, bro, I just found this whole civilization of goblins, and I'm gonna go turn into fucking confederates. Like, it's just shit you can you can do anything you want. So this is not gonna be a standard, but it it, it shows that if you just take your time to make a good game, people are not gonna complain. They're just gonna be happy you're making a good game. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Imagine it's, this it's, game it's, not being game of the year. It's Imagine not gonna be game of the year. It's not gonna be game of the year. You don't think so? Absolutely you don't think not. So? I think that's a pretty good shot. What's, it what, should uh, be. What? It it should be. It's not going to be, be Spider-Man or something like that. No, it's no, not going to be Spider-Man. Absolutely not. Spider-Man doesn't no stand way. a fucking chance. <laughs> it's, I'm sorry. It's, it's not going to be. It's not going to be game of the year. I, or look, it might be look. Starfield. Or it might be no. Starfield or some shit. No, I don't think so. Tears we'll, we'll is probably we'll a second. I don't know. Sorry, we'll it's uh, Tears. Yeah. It, it might be tears. I just I can can't imagine tears anything coming close. There is no way this is going to be game of the year. Because if this makes game of the year, really, if this makes game of the year. Because it's it's for first and foremost, if it makes game of the year, right? What it's gonna do is gonna perpetuate that stupid feeling of like, hey guys, maybe you should do games better like this. And the game company, the game world, got that last year, and they <laughs> bitched the shit from it. There's oh, still bitching about Elden it Ring? from, you're from talking about Elden, Elden Ring. Ring or what? <laughs> from Elden Ring, they were just like, no, what do you mean? A... We, we're not gonna do extra work. I don't want to make good games. No, I don't want to try hard. No, that's funny. You're not gonna make me do this. No, I understand. I, don't think so. I understand I don't the think sentiment. So. That's funny, though. So. Dude, the, funny. the shit, silly. the shit talking that came out for this game a month before it dropped, and everybody talking about how it's like this is unrealistic ideas of video game creation. It's like it's not unrealistic. It's just simply when care is added to a game. Right. If yeah. you just take your time it's and make knowing, a good game, a good game will be made. You know. It's it's knowing where to where to invest your resources really it's just instead of like trying to figure out how to maximize profits in an in-game shop that's going to take like a ton of r&d to figure out how to like ooh, how do we how do we make the perfect sound to really tickle somebody's fucking brain that makes them want to pay money um instead of like focusing on fidelity instead of focusing on like oh hey you can see every single pore on this person's skin uh let's just make a fucking <laughs> cool fucking game like the game the game looks great but it doesn't it's not like graphically fucking Ama like, it looks, it's not the most amazing it, thing I've ever fucking yeah. seen. It's it's a pretty standard it looks looking. Like what a, it looks like what a game this generation should look like. Like it yeah, looks, it looks like, very yeah. good. I, I, yeah, <laughs> I wouldn't it. say. I, I I would say like it doesn't look so. It doesn't look special necessarily. Like when you're looking at it, it looks like a standard like. Well, every, it, like just, the animations are kind of janky. Like some things don't work all that well, but it doesn't matter because the systems work and the branching yeah. paths of systems work and the, and and like everything that you do has an impact on everything around it and that branches out and that carries forward oh, the character and that's where they... the world the, the world it's is cool. the world is tangible every spell you use interacts with the planet itself not just the enemies who use it on like it's it's just it's literally just what dragon age was now 
in the it's, future. It's, yeah. it's basically it's, like what you would say, like, oh, yeah, on some, when something's on steroids. Yeah. What the, the maximum potential of this idea, this concept of something. And then it's just been fleshed out to the point where it's kind of overwhelming, where I'm like, holy, there is so much there. It, 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 and, and, and I got to say, uh, the... The even with the even with the combat of how I'm like, oh, there's there is so dynamic much shit, shit you can dude, it's do. Dynamic it's, as it's fuck, bro. It's ridiculous. It's you almost can push a- motherfuckers off high places, dude. I've beat so many b- fights in that game where I just shove people. I have a barbarian. I make them use their rage, and they push this enemy <laughs> off a high place, <laughs> and they <laughs> die. Yeah, that is yeah. like. Like, I played the original Early Access, like, maybe, like, four times already. I'm 30 mm-hmm. hours in, and I'm just at the end of Act 1. I haven't even touched Act 2 yet. Yeah, yeah. I've, I've I haven't only, even scraped I'm it, like, bro. I, I'm, like, I, eight hours. I'm, I'm only eight hours in. I'm pretty, I'm pretty early. I, I'm even less. I only did the right. opening sequence. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. It do- it's dope as shit. Yo, kill that. Did you, did, you get, did you kill the fucking demon dude with the flaming sword? So, I was... I wasn't sure. I was Let's not going get super to, into like, but then, yeah. But I was. It's. Uh, I'll, I'll, yeah. But I, I was going yeah, to. Yeah. But then I was like, strategically, I want to make sure I have enough turns. I don't want to. <laughs> you know, I don't. I don't want to like play around with it. Like I see on my next playthrough, I be like, okay, I, I'm. I'm good enough to where because this. This. The strict. The strategic nature of this. It's still something a little bit new to me, like playing mm. like um a, like some type of uh RPG. It plays a little bit. It plays a little bit like a tactics game. Mm-hmm. Um, Absolutely, except it's a little. This is like f- it's uh-huh. a little fucky. I, I, I don't know. There's some times where I'm like, I, I'll, oh, combat has been engaged, and then like one of my characters can go, and then the rest of them can go after the enemy goes, and I'm like, I don't. I don't understand how the game makes this decision at all. Oh, it's uh, it's an it's, issue. Uh, I guess it's du- it's an issue from Dungeons and Dragons. That's whoever has the highest annoying. dexterity yeah. score. Yeah, goes for yeah, it. yeah. The, the, yeah dexterity the is simple. like your speed. The thing, essentially, the thing that holds the entire game back for me is literally the fact that it's Dungeons and Dragons. Like, I feel like I would love this game <laughs> if it was if it was if it was any other IP. I would love it, but like because it's like yeah. there's a there's a goblin here and and you've got a fucking oh you got a mind flayer or whatever in your head and I'm like oh, okay. Um, Dude, you're missing. That, it, it's it's narratively kind of such a good game. It's wild, bro. It, 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 That's so crazy it, to me. You're like, you're like, you're like, the, the fact that this is the the cornerstone of role playing games, rich with more lore than any game has possibly, is a minus to me. And that's like, oh, okay, cool. Well, <laughs> it's, it's like more, saying, it's, man, it's, this movie, this movie is about the most interesting person on the planet, and I don't like that. That's what oh, I'm no, hearing it's, from you. It's pretty like, much. hey, it's more about like, hey, this is the best movie ever made. Also, it's 200 hours. It's like, okay, well, I, you know, you wouldn't watch okay. the best movie ever made 200 hours. You wouldn't break no, that up in pieces and watch it. Not. No, I would not. That's crazy. I'd watch the fuck out of that. Not. That's an experience. No, because here's the thing. I get it. To I mean, me, go ahead. Well, no, no. What were you gonna say? No, no, no. I was just big, big. Piggybacking, piggybacking off of what you're saying. Piggybacking off of what you're saying. Those on racist and also is bigotbacking. That's an awesome. That's an awesome accidental phrase. Like bigotbacking is like is like if someone's shouting slurs and you're like, yeah, I agree, but I don't want to say it. (laughs) (laughs) You fucking bigotbacker. Bigotbacking. Oh my god. Back backing that shit. No, but but, uh, wait, wait, wait. wait. Sorry to interrupt. Sorry to interrupt. Sorry to interrupt. Okay, what? Have you guys seen the thing with the girl that sounds like SpongeBob? You guys have to have seen it, right? I have. I I, 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 It's so. (laughs) I found it. I found it thoroughly underwhelming, honestly. Like, I was like, this is fucking lame and not funny. Why does she sound like SpongeBob? Just talking? No, there's a girl getting getting, getting right piped down, but she sounds like SpongeBob crying during it. And it's so fucking funny. Yeah, I, because I, I, someone uh, put someone put actual SpongeBob music in the background, <laughs> and like it was so what? funny. Yeah, it was one of the I don't know. That was one of the lamer things I saw recently. I don't know. It didn't do anything for me. I, I yeah, somebody somebody showed it to good? me. I was like, all right. It could have been mm. fun. It, like it was oversold. I think. Like it's funny, but it's not like I didn't laugh at it. But I'll the, put it in a chat the, for Derek. But the one thing, oh, okay. the one thing I'll say about Baldur's Gate is that, like, it's it's just um, I found it's, it. I just don't. Oh yeah, I'll, I'll let him experience. The I'll the SpongeBob music experience. makes it way better. Oh, yeah, look at him! Look at him silently, <laughs> just smiling a little bit. 
It's also kind of disgusting. I, yeah. Like, it, it doesn't, she, like the, why the, does the she thing sound is, like that? She's going it's, through it. He's running her through, man. He's running it's weird. It's weird, but the SpongeBob-ness of it doesn't really kick in for me. Like, it doesn't, it never nah. kicks in. For me, it's just like, why does she, like, what's, what is happening down there? Like, what's, what's the situation? Like, yeah. Kim Possible, bro, what's the sitch? Like, he's probably, like, he's way too well endowed or something. <laughs> <laughs> and she's just, like, not enjoying that at all, bro, because that is, that's not, yeah. That, Poking her lungs. That does not sound like good sex, dude, at all. No, that sounds, <laughs> sounds rough. Like it, it, it sounds, I'm having a rough time. Right. But, uh, but fucking, dun, I don't dun, know, man, dun, like, dun, dun, dun. it, it. Go ahead. I think what it comes down to for me, honestly, is that, like, I, I just prefer real time. Like, if I'm in an RPG world, I, I prefer it to be real time. Like, there there is something it. about the overhead and the kind of turn-based nature of it that feels like... I understand, the, the, like, what it like what the point of it is. I understand, like, oh, you get to, like, kind of think tactically. I understand that, like, oh, you roll, and then you kind of... It's like a game of dice, and you're kind of, like, rolling... You're playing with fate every time you try anything, really. Like, and I get that. That's cool. But to me, it's like that dice roll is kind of done automatically in a real time game. Like, if if I if my dexterity is low in real life, then my dexterity is low. Like, if I can't aim for shit with my arrow, then I'm fucked. You know, like I miss the shot, and that's that to me is that dice roll, and it doesn't interrupt the flow of what I'm doing to do that. If that makes sense. I see. Do you, do, you know were I mean? you uh, were you someone that liked playing like solitaire? No. Yeah, exactly. That's that. Yeah. Like, there's th like it's like there's like I feel like there's like two types of lanes. There's people that like to do this tactical bullshit, and then there's people that are like ah, it's just, it's just not not for me. And I like I'm I, I'm I'm in the both camps. But I will say that to the certain extent, the one thing that I don't really I'm not used to with Baldur's Gate is the uh wasting a turn on movement where that's something that like really kind of it, the uh, most rpgs that i play i'm not used yeah. to that so i'm used, used to it, just advancing yeah. and then just fighting and I, so i understand the idea of like because in because in this game it's isometric as well that's the thing it's it's different from yeah, yeah. most other other rpgs that are turn-based because it's like it's it's a, it's a combination of like three kinds of games together that's why uh -huh. That puts it into like what it is as D and D. I understand the movement shit is fucking annoying because you're like, oh, I want to go fight this guy. Up, I'm only I only have X amount of movement forward. Then I gotta stop. I can dash. I wait. That takes my whole action to dash. Mm -hmm. so I'll get up to him and I'm just in their face, but I can't fight them at the moment. Yeah. So at that moment, that's when that's when strategy comes in. That's when spell casting and all that shit gets yeah. added into the game. But I understand. Like for me personally, it's like I like I like the idea to be able to plan things. Because the idea of planning something, setting it up, and then it working is so fulfilling to me. Yeah. Right. That is my that is what I really enjoy. I also do like playing real time games. Like I play Destiny all the time. Destiny's a real time RPG sort of with guns. Yeah, I mean you play both of them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm, yeah. So I'm I'm, they're, I'm like they're, I'm like in both camps. They're they're different styles of game. I have never been a like it's with rare exception am I a turn based person. Like like I I don't I specifically I don't like any card games at all. I don't like playing cards. I don't like waiting for people. <laughs> I don't I, I like I I I've played there are tactics games I, I do like, to be fair. But that's more I don't know. That's this but a lot simpler. It's less I don't know, it's it's less uh there's no like initiative. It's just like your turn, my turn, your turn, my turn. I can handle that. Yeah. But like the second I, I don't know why it's my like I mean you cleared it up with initiative and all that stuff. I didn't even I wasn't even thinking about that because I'm not a D and D person. But um, yeah, there was this, that, that is one then, thing too. Uh, go ahead, there's D and D. There's, but then there's things that I think about. Like it's like okay, it's D and D. So what can I do? It's like and I think about like oh what do I want to do? It's like I'm talking. This isn't necessarily a spoiler. It's pretty early on in the game. But there's a goblin lady that I'm talking to right now that I know has a sleep potion because <laughs> if I go to if I go to pickpocket it, it says she has a sleep potion. It's like, okay. And she, when we get into combat, she alerts everybody around you that, like, she's being attacked. And it's like, okay, well, I want to kill her without, uh, without alerting anybody. So it's like, if I can pickpocket the sleep, sleep potion, like, can I, like, can I make her fall asleep? And as far as I've been able to tell, I, I have no fucking idea how to do that. You can. And no, nothing I try works. And so I'm left to be oh. like, all right, well... What I, you I do know. to her is this, right? So then what you do is this, right? At that moment, it's like D&D's idea is with the tools you have available, how can you do X, Y, or Z? That's pretty much right. how what you have to figure out, right? Yeah. So 
for me and things like them in that encounter that exact encounter i know where you are what yeah. i did is i just hit the bitch i snuck up to her and i hit her <laughs> and she died and then i took the potion <laughs> yeah but you're a barbarian or something probably no no i was a rogue. a rogue that character is as a rogue you sneak attack him you sneak up to her where no one's around you don't bring any of your homes with you, you go by yourself on some on some thorough dark thirty shit, and you hit her, <laughs> you hit her, you kill the bitch, you take the potion. Or what I did was really fucked up. There's another area where like you're talking about that, where there's a bunch of drums all around. I played as a ranger, and I made my bird go in there and break every drum, so they couldn't call each other to help each other out. Oh, <laughs> and interesting. Right. Yeah, I, I, I didn't I didn't know about yeah. the drums. Yeah, I mean it's like, cool. There's it's, so it's, many. It's it's really there's so cool. much just, to do, but I'm trying to be overwhelming. The option, it's probably like say, you know, when people would, cause I, I would, you know, rarely, I would, I would, I don't really defend Ubisoft ever, but I, I once would go because people would criticize the newer Assassin's Creed games for being too like, oh, there's too many icons and directions and kind of telling you how to do everything. But I would say, hey, you can also turn all that shit off. And I feel like in this yeah. game, I'm like, okay, is there something where I could turn it on a little bit to where it can at least kind of give me a little bit of a guidance because I know it's the idea is it's o it's open you do what you want but then I feel like there's a I probably the average gamer is going to go through this having no fucking idea that they can it interact is, with yeah, certain things it, like it is, that it is tricky to find st because a lot of there's there's a specific part with like a windmill and like where you have to like break mm -hmm. like you have you have to and I was looking for that break for so long because I was thinking like, oh, it's it's an isometric game. It must be big enough for me to see from this perspective. And it's like, no, you have to like zoom the fuck in to see this small <laughs> break. And I'm like, bro, like, yeah. come on. Like, if there's like a if, if there was cool. like a highlight interactable, and I understand that that's like probably no, like there some, is. Like, you, don't, you, don't, you don't know the highlight button for things. I know it's alt. left all. I know it's left all, but it doesn't highlight interactables. It, it highlights lootables. As far as I know, oh, so it's it's not everything that you can it, interact it, with. It's just it's just stuff that you can loot, pick up. Okay, all right, which is useful. I don't know too, how I, by I, the way, I, but... I found that windmill thing by mistake. So I went to the thing and I, 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 the, the first few times I just stopped it and I reversed it, and homie just went flying. You just see like a little dark body flying through the sky, and I'm like, <laughs> damn. <laughs> There's also this one thing too where I was where like, there's also, thing, there's also this one thing too where like one of my one of one of the people in my party got captured and and they were like, get me out of this cage. I'm like, okay. And then I go around the corner to look for like a lever or something, and then it just it says you left her to her fate. And I'm like, well, I mean, <laughs> you gotta I just shoot the bottom of the I cage. Went, you gotta I shoot the bottom. There's no the... lever. There's a trap. You know what's funny? I don't know. You know I, I fucking there's nothing to interact you know what's with. What's funny and about every that? Every time I aimed at it, it didn't say like damage. It didn't say like it could receive damage. And I was like, okay, I guess I don't know. So I was looking for Dude, something funny to that... let her down, and then I I fucking failed it. So I was like, all right, I guess she's gone. <laughs> Fuck her anyway. I didn't like her. <laughs> that she is sucks. so funny, bro. That's how I actually. You know, that's how I felt initially. The opening part of the game. The opening part where that bitch is trapped where I was like, wait. You left her? No, I didn't. But the thing was, it took me a minute to figure out what to do because I was thinking, if I go forward, probably she's fucked for some reason. That was my initial thought of like, oh, see, if I, I, you know what? I didn't, if I leave, I, I, didn't, I didn't think that because I thought this is the best RPG known to man. Surely I can walk around the fucking corner and she'll stay there. But like, no, <laughs> immediately, like it said autosave, like you left her to her fate. Then I went back and she was gone. I was like, bro, that's... I mean, like, I get it. it. Like, it's, it's, no game can no, no, be perfect, no, no, no. but let no, no, no. me it's, look it's around. Just, it's, no, no, no. It's just the idea of you guys don't know how deeply you can interact or not. That's no, it. Well, that's, that's that, all it is. That, it's just it's, it's, it's the idea of that. That's true as well, but also, like, I'm thinking back to other RPGs I've played where, like, someone's trapped. Like, I think about, like, Skyrim or something where, like, someone's trapped in something, and you have to go through the entire mm -hmm. dungeon to get I them agree, out yeah. and i'm like okay yeah. well okay so my knowledge is and telling you're not, me you're this. not wrong and so like all right i didn't care that about particular she sucked. instance she sucked. Lizelle, I hated her. She sucks. sucks she's so powerful she is That's fine. so strong but the That's thing fine. is like for me like things like that right it's she's like, gone bitch i saw her, i saw <laughs> this person i saw this person uh, uh, um uh i forgot like held up right L lifted aloft and i'm like hmm you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna shoot the bottom of that 
Because there's, I don't see any, I don't see where she's being lifted from. So I just shot the bottom. She fell out. She's like, "You fucking bitch!" I hit myself, and I'm like, "Yeah, whatever." Yeah. You, you know what out? I? You know what? You know what <laughs> I thought? <laughs> it. You know what I thought it was like? Because I tried to zoom out as far as I can, and then like the, it's the cage, and then it's hooked up to a thing, and then there's like kind of like a cliff overhead, and I was like, "Oh, mm -hmm. maybe like maybe this path wraps around and up, and there's like a thing to like detach the trap." That's what I was thinking. And I'm an mm. idiot, I guess. I should just... I, I, I assume every you're an, you're solution... Not a, you're not an idiot. I'm going to assume... You're not an idiot. I'm, I'm, I'm going yeah. to assume from now on that every solution to every problem is on the fucking same screen that the problem is on. Because that seems to be the case. Because like, I, well, I don't want to fuck up. I don't want to... I don't, or, or I'll just continuously I mean, save. You, Dude, I've been save scumming save, like crazy. Yeah, save. I've been Dude, save that scumming like a I dick. That is how I play... RPGs in general, like when I... The first playthrough of Skyrim, especially because of the crashing... Like the first playthrough of Skyrim, oh, yeah, I saved yeah, yeah. the save, fuck out of Skyrim. Dude. I saved, bro. I had <laughs> three different. This motherfucker, Chris. You remember you made me a fucking vampire, you piece of shit. You stupid fuck. You, remember you did that. <laughs> I don't remember that. What are you talking about? You did that. You were like, oh my bad. You just made me a vampire. And I was like, oh Chris, my bad. That's I hate great. you so oh, much. Oh yeah, you went, you went downstairs to get your like Chipotle or something, and I walked into a vampire's and got bitten and walked back and paused. Uh, I wasn't even a good vampire. I was one of those raggedy vampires. I was one of the, like, the <laughs> fucking raggedy ones. And I was You're like, I don't even get anything cool from this. Oh, my but yeah, God. I, I but like, for Skyrim, uh, I had, like, so four different <laughs> save files. <laughs> yeah. I feel like there's... I'm going to look into... Uh, if I can't... If I can't... Because um, I don't have this that much time. This guy's not going to look into Jack shit. He's not going to look into anything. Look at him. Pretending yeah, he's going to look yeah, into something. I guess. What are you talking about? It's... Yeah, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> That's so fucking mean. <laughs> whatever. I mean, I'm looking to. No, you're fucking not. Yeah, you're right. I'm not gonna I be watched. Able to. <laughs> the funny thing is, I, I watched a bunch of videos, kind of prepping myself. But then I made the decision. It was Joe. It was JoJo that because I talked to her about like, damn. Every time I get on social media, somebody's fucking coming about Baldur's Gate. It's just yeah. That's all I keep seeing. And I kept telling myself, I'll play later when eventually I'll find, like, a Steam key that's, like, 10 bucks off or something. And I'm like, all right, just to, like, kind of justify not buying, you know, something, I, 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 should, I should be using my money more wisely. But whatever. She fucking has money, dude. So she's like, here, play. And I'm like, oh, hell yeah, dude. That, that's, that's, that is that, that's better. that free shit rules. Free shit yeah, rules, it's, man. It's better than that's, why, that's why you have them. That's why you have those. Exactly. That's the reason... Exactly why she exists, I, and nothing. I figured more. I would. I figured I just bought it because, like, I saw I saw everybody praising it. I had it on pretty good authority that it was probably like a really good game, and I was like, you know what? I'll su I'll support. Because uh, because I was under the uh, initially, I was gonna buy it and just never play it because I was just like, whatever. Nice. I'll, I'll I'll toss a toss toss a coin to the Witcher and fucking just move on because, <laughs> quite frankly, <laughs> yeah. like good games deserve support. Like I. If that's, that's if I can, true. you're you're right. If if and I'm fortunately in a position where I can, I can do something like that every every once in a while. I'm not gonna go crazy and buy fucking everything, but um, <laughs> but this is one of those examples where I'm like, all right, yeah, fuck it, whatever. They they seem to have made like a, a game of the year contender here. I'll I'll fucking buy it. Uh, send yeah. a message that we want more of this stuff. Uh, but I don't know, man. I, I gotta put more. I, I, oh, I'm only eight hours in, so. I, I gotta. Yeah, it, yeah I'm way it. less. I'm fucking way less. I, I know. I just, I'm working on so many projects that I'm like, fuck. I almost, almost wish she didn't buy it for me because now it's like, oh great. Yeah, I yeah, know I'm yeah. gonna neglect other shit, and I'm gonna start going ham because now that we're talking about it, not that your brain I, is thinking, your brain I is moving in a way you're like, oh. Want to play as soon as the week done? I like. I want to fucking <laughs> yeah, yeah. turn it on. <laughs> I want to well, as well. I have well, shit to do. Unfortunately, well, you know what? Unfortunately, let's I have move... somebody coming over to my house. 